Hello and welcome to this video on how to set up 802.1x authentication profile for mass deployment. In this video, we will set up the profile on a Windows Server 2012 R2 and deploy the profile to a MacBook Air as a Wi-Fi profile. Here are the different aspects in setting up the profiles. Setting up certificate template, setting up network policy, setting up group policy, and deploying the group policy. So we begin by setting up a certificate template. You may skip this part if you already have a certificate template that is currently being used. In the certificate templates console, right-click the workstation authentication certificate item and select duplicate template. In general tab, change the template name to a meaningful name, for example, Mac auto enroll certs. In subject name tab, select the radio button Build this from AD information, change the subject name format to common name. Check both DNS name and user principal name to include this information in alternative subject name. In security tab, set the desired computer group to allow enroll and auto enroll permissions. Press OK to save the new template. After generating the machine certificate with the created template, we will then use it in your network policy. If you are not using Microsoft Network Policy Server, you will have to contact your third-party network policy vendor for support on setting up the RADIUS server. At the Network Policy Server, under Policies, select Network Policies. Select the network policy and edit its properties. In Constraints tab, select Authentication Methods. You will see the item Microsoft Smart card or other certificate under EAP types. Edit it and select the certificate using the drop down list. Please make sure that the certificate selected is being trusted by the certificate authority. To set up the group policy, open the group policy editor, then navigate to Computer Configurations, Policies, Centrify Settings, Mac OS X Settings. 802.1x settings, machine Wi-Fi profile. Enable the policy add a Wi-Fi profile by setting the SSID to your Wi-Fi setup with radius. Then change the template name to the certificate template you set up previously. Press OK to save the policy. By default, the group policy is updated about every 90 minutes. If you require the policy to be immediately effective, you can open the Mac Diagnostic 2 at slash library slash application support slash centrify. Select group policy tab and press the GP update button to trigger the update process. During the group policy update process, go to system preference and select networks. Under the Wi-Fi network, you will see that it is connecting to the SSID of your radius enabled network. When the update process is completed, you will see the policy entries under Machine Policy. You can also go to Profiles of System Preference to verify that the Wi-Fi profile of your previous configuration is being deployed.